Horror fans who have waited for Guillermo del Toro's return to the genre may be disappointed with his newest film that he wrote and produced himself. Don't Be Afraid of the Dark, a remake of the 1977 made-for-TV horror film of the same name, features subpar acting and more holes in the plot than a chunk of Swiss cheese. The film revolves around your basic elements of any horror movie, a creepy old house, a creepy young girl, and one element that isn't featured much, demons who feast on children's teeth. That's right, teeth. I don't like it here. Sally, what do you think? We worked really hard to get it ready. Now, Guy Just Pierce, who you may recognize from right Memento, is daddy of the creepy little girl that I mentioned earlier. Now, Pierce is usually prone to being emotionless in his roles, and this film is no different. In several scenes, I can't tell if he's happy his house is haunted or if he just really has to use the bathroom. And Katie Holmes, who you may recognize as, well, Tom Cruise's wife, actually pulls through as a believable character. I mean, I haven't seen her in, in, in anything since, well, Batman Begins, and she was so bad in that movie that they replaced her with Maggie Gyllenhaal in the sequel. But overall, this horror film just lacked the scares and bumps in the night that I was so desperately hoping for given that Del Toro's name was so closely attached to it. I'm going to have to give Don't Be Afraid of the Dark a 2 out of 5.